Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to try and grab some images from the International Space Station. Hey guys, welcome back. I'm glad you could join me today. In my live broadcast this week, I mentioned that the ISS was going to be sending down slow scan TV images for anyone to receive with a radio and some decoding software. So if you have an SDR or a receiver, you can get these yourself and decode them. Today I was able to actually record the pass on a baseband recording so I could share it with you guys. So the basics of this are you need a receiving device. I used the software defined radios. I did a whole video on how to buy these and several other videos on how to use them. So go ahead and check those out. I used SDR Sharp free software as well as MultiPSK, which is also free software. You'll see in the video upcoming that uh, I activate the baseband recording, and then I activate MultiPSK, and it's as simple as that. The, the process is all automated from there. It takes some time as the ISS goes over. You'll see me correcting for Doppler as we progress through the pass. Uh, I'll, th I'll speed this up so you don't have to watch it real time. No sense in doing that. It's a little slow. But I was able to capture a great image, and it looks like they're alternating images from the ISS multiple times per day right now. Uh, there, mine was numbered, so uh, I, I'm assuming that there's a whole series of them, and perhaps uh, in a couple of days from now when the next passes uh, come over, there'll be even more. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy. Please uh, reach out if you have any questions or comments. Good luck with all your software-defined radio, amateur radio, electronics, and other projects. Thank <laughs> you. 